Adventures with Bash, the Bash Challenges. And I think I'm at the last one now. There's a challenge, glue sniffing. Don't know if that came up on the lemon. Anyway. So, Bash's uh, last challenge. Do as many moto vlogs as you can in one ride. So, let's see now. Carl's Jr. Carl's Jr. is a recent arrival in New Zealand. They say it is the fattiest fast food that you can get. And my teenagers tell me it's delicious. Traffic lights. There's another vlog. Love them or hate them. What do you think of traffic lights? I think traffic lights are the great equaliser. When you get somebody hooning past you, especially in a built-up area like this, and then a set of traffic lights will bring everybody down to the same level. Traffic lights, the great equaliser. Oh, there's another subject. Tattoo. There's a big tattoo parlour up there. It's all the rage these days. It's not just sailors and uh, sailors and prostitutes <laughs> that have got tattoos. Every man and his dog nowadays uh, <laughs> seems to have a tattoo. The youngsters, the old ones, all sorts. Personally, I haven't got a tattoo. I've got nothing against them. It's just that I've never come across anything that I would like to have on my body for the rest of my life. <coughs> my kids have. Uh, the latest one to get a couple of tattoos is my 19-year-old son. My oldest son, he's got both arms, I think, fairly well covered. And my daughter, She's got um, some very small ones running up her arm representing her family. My wife has none. I've always said to her that she should get one across the top of her bum. Property of Marty. <laughs> she doesn't think that's a good idea. I don't know why. All right, better calm down and think about my speed because there was a speed camera back there. <laughs> okay, um, where there's smoke, there's fire. I can see some smoke in front of me behind this big industrial building. This is actually a big brewery, Dominion Breweries. One of the two main brewers in the country. What's that smoke all about? Where there's smoke, there's fire. Is that always true? Is it always smoke? Sometimes it's just steam and vapour. Will we be able to find out? Or am I going to be heading off to where I'm going before we get there? Spinal injuries. There's a spinal, uh, spinal unit over here. They do some amazing work with people with injuries, rehabilitation, getting, teaching people how to walk again and all that sort of thing. And here comes that great equaliser, the traffic light. Now the question is, for this vlog, should I have come up and filtered past this single car? Or should I just wait here until the lights change and just take my time? Well, the fact of the matter is, I'm in no hurry. It's a nice day. Just finished work. So, I chose to bide my time. Fences on bridges over motorways. There's another one. Why do we have them? There's several motorway over bridges in South Auckland that have these big huge fences across them. Why is that? Well, unfortunately, it's because on one of these bridges, a few years ago, a bright young spark, a boy of about 12 or 13, thought it was a good idea to throw a big lump of concrete off the bridge down onto the motorway that went straight through the windscreen of a car, instantly killing the driver, who was a young guy of about 21, a 
basketball representative or something like that and he was on his way to a match here in Auckland with his fiance beside him in the car what a horrific thing to happen so because of the brainless activity of one person they've installed the big huge fences to stop that happening around some of the uh, overbridges Oh, one last vlog. <laughs> one last vlog for Bash's challenge. How many vlogs can you do in one ride? Um, coming up in front of us, getting the camera pick it up, is the Tip Top Ice Cream Factory. And we like to think we make the best ice cream in the world here in New Zealand. <laughs> and that's where the major manufacturer of Tip Top Ice Cream is.